Peace and blessings, family. Peace and blessings. This is your brother, Sean Ali, here at Supreme Health and Fitness by Sean Ali. And as always, I thank you all for tuning in and giving me some of your valuable time. And as always, I pray that this brief message is received in the spirit that I'm striving to deliver it in, which is the spirit of your brother, the spirit of love, and of course, and always, in the spirit and in the name of God. Um, I just want to briefly go into understanding and creating the energy that you and I, that we need to facilitate our healing, to become healthy, and to make manifest our power. And we have to understand that we, everything is energy. So when we're looking at Healing, health, life, death, these are all levels of energy, frequencies of energy. Uh, um, your emotions, they all are frequencies of energy because everything is energy. So your body is created to produce almost all of everything it needs. And even when it's in a short supply of a particular element, it's designed to take other elements of your body and transform it into what it needs because your body's number one function is to provide the vehicle, to provide the physical vehicle for your spirit, for your force and power to have a home. So you can be here and you can take your wonderful brain and your ideas and you can create and build and you can do all kind of uh, um, awesome and powerful things. So when we are looking at those of us that need to be healed, those of us that want to become healthy, those of us that want to improve the quality of our life, those of us that want to become more powerful, we have to, it's not by magic. It's not by prayer. It's not by, it's because power and energy is real. So we have to turn to the real sources and then we, and we can give our body the elements that it needs and it can perpetually and continuously create the energy that we need. And then that, that energy will fuel us into successfully enjoying our abundant life because that should be your number one end product or your number one goal should be able to create the environment so that you can enjoy your abundant life. So we have to understand that the current uh, um, time length that we live is not even a tenth of the human potential of our potential. We are looking at the, because if you die right now, your body does not magically disappear. It's still here. It takes years for your body to go from a state of, of what it is now to a state of deterioration. It takes years for your skin and your nails and your tissues and your bones to deteriorate, to turn back into the matter that it was originally taken from, as they say, ashes to ashes and dust to dust. So what are the elements of energy? The number one source of energy in our ecosystem is the sun. So in this book, Life Energy, the sun, glucose, and why humans are herbivores, I take a scientific look at our energy and how you and I can produce the energy that we need for healing to become healthy and to become powerful without taxing our body, mainly our digestive system. So when we look at when we look at our energy, our basic form of energy is ATP or adenosine triphosphate. And it's a three chain molecule that the mitochondria in your cell produces. Now, 
the number one source of energy is the sun. So when we look at photosynthesis, we look at the plant takes the sunlight, it takes your O2, your CO2, and it changes it. It 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 takes the the sunlight and it takes your CO2 and it and it changes it into a carbohydrate. Right? So it changes it into a car. Glucose. Now, when you eat this glucose, your body and the mitochondria in your cells, it takes this glucose and it takes oxygen. And it forms what we know as ATP. Now, when your body needs energy, it takes this three chain molecule and it breaks the bond. And in this bond is the sunlight. See, so this, because energy, everything is energy. Energy cannot be destroyed, it can only be transferred and transformed. So when we're looking at life energy, the sun, glucose, and why humans are herbivores, because in the plant, in the fabric of the plant, through the act of photosynthesis, the sunlight is transformed into a molecule called a carbohydrate. And in the best form, it is glucose, the, out, the, the sugar. So when you eat this, your body takes it and it transforms it again. And it takes your oxygen and it converts it into ATP. So when you need energy, your body will break a bond to release that sunlight. And it will fuel you for whatever you need, whether it's cellular growth and development, whether it's healing, Whatever you need, your body needs that energy for, that's what it will convert it into. So we are looking at the two ingredients. You need sunlight and you need oxygen. So you need sunlight, right? And you need oxygen, the breath of life in atomic form. So listen to me, and your body now, when you in the sun, when you eat the sun or you go out and you stand in the sun and you breathe as created, you have the ingredients for ATP, for energy. So when your body needs the energy it for healing, to become healthy, for power, it is dependent upon sunlight in the form of glucose in oxygen, the breath of life in atomic form. So now, if you lack energy, if you lack the energy that you need for healing, if you lack the energy you need to become healthy, if you lack the energy you need for power, if you lack the energy you need to expand your life, you don't have to go to a doctor. You don't have to go to a drugstore. You gotta look at how it, or what the sources of your energy is. That's why I call it life energy. Because it is the energy of life. So when we are looking at healing, when we are looking at health, when we are looking at power, we have the foundations for it are free, sunlight and oxygen. That's the what God gave us. You don't have to buy it. God gave it to us. So if you don't go into the sun, if you don't breathe as created, then you create the environment in yourself where you become oxygen deficient. You become sunlight deficient. So your, your, the mitochondria in your cell, it doesn't have the ingredients it needs to produce energy. So you become powerless. You become tired. 
The mitochondria, the DNA inside of your cells become corrupted because they don't have enough energy to sustain it. Your cells start to oxidize, cellular oxidation. That means that your cells are starting to die. Once the cell dies, the tissue dies, the organ dies, the system dies, and then you die. So now, if we know that that is the foundation and movement of death. So if you breathe right, if you go and you get the ingredients that your body needs for energy, the, this is the ingredients your body needs for life. It needs sunlight. It needs the sun, glucose, and why humans are herbivores. And it needs oxygen the breath of life in atomic form. These are the ingredients for life. That's in the ingredients for your energy. That's the ingredients for your healing. That's the ingredients for being healthy. That's the ingredients for making manifest power. So I just wanted to come with this brief message for us to understand and creating the energy that you and I, that we need to facilitate healing, to boost and uh, uh, increase or become healthy, to make manifest power. So when we don't, when we don't eat right, when we don't go into the sun, the sunlight is, manifested in the form of glucose the sun glucose and why humans are herbivores because the end product of photosynthesis is glucose so if you don't eat plants not just eating plants but if you don't grow the plants that you need then this if you go to the grocery store you don't know how long those plants or those fruits and vegetables have been sitting inside the building. There is no sunlight inside the grocery store. There is no sunlight in the back of the truck. See, so once they pick and harvest these fruits and vegetables, now they are putting them inside of containers with no sunlight. They are on back of the truck with no sunlight. They are sitting in the grocery store with no sunlight. So when you go to eat it, it, had, it might have been removed from the sun long enough where there's no energy in it. Where the nutritional value is low to none. So if you don't grow your own food, so when you need energy, you can go and harvest it while it's still in the sun. At its peak of perfection. And if we don't breathe right, remember your mouth. If you put the food in your mouth, then you should know that your mouth is not connected to your lungs. If you put the food in your mouth, then you should know that your mouth is not connected to your lungs. That your, your mouth is the beginning of your GI tract. It's a one-way street. What goes in is not meant to come out. So when we're looking at understanding and creating the energy that you and I need for healing to become healthy and to manifest power, you can't buy it. God has given us the ingredients, sunlight and oxygen. And if you are missing both of these or one of these, then you and I, we don't have the ingredients for life energy. You don't have the ingredients to heal. You don't have the ingredients to be healthy. You don't have the ingredients for power. You don't have the ingredients for life. 
And the longer that you keep yourself without sunlight, the longer you keep yourself in an oxygen deficient state, then you will suffer premature death. So here at Supreme Health and Fitness, we have the formulas, we have the science. These are the science books. Life energy, the sun, glucose, and why humans are herbivores. Oxygen, the breath of life in atomic form. To help you, so because, listen, the, this is the science. It's not, why are you sick? The question is, why isn't your body healing itself? Because your body is designed to heal itself. Listen to me. You know your current condition. You know how you exercise. You know how you eat. You know how you drink. You know what. You know all of the things that you do. Now, if you knowing your present condition, knowing that we need help right now, if you go and you cut your finger and you don't do nothing to it. And you come back a couple of days later and your finger has started to heal without you doing anything to it. That means your body still has the power it needs to heal. Now, imagine if you help it. See, whoa, listen now, listen. In your present condition, your body still has the ability to heal without you doing anything to it. So just imagine if you help it, if you breathe right, if you go out and you get the sun and you give your body the ingredients it needs to create life energy. Woo! You can heal yourself overnight. Don't let nobody tell you about your body. It's Listen, it's your body. It's nobody can look at you and tell you that you can't heal. It's nobody that can look at you and tell you you got an expiration date on you. They can't tell you that you're ready to die. It's your body. It does what you tell it to do. It's your body. Everything that you did today, it's because you wanted to do it. So if you want to heal, if you want to be healthy, if you want to be powerful, if you want to be God, all you got to do is want to do it, to know how to do it. And control and command your body to heal, to be healthy, to be powerful. And it will listen because it is designed to do what you tell it to do. So I just wanted to come with this brief message, man. I thank everybody for tuning in and giving me some of your valuable time and your energy. I'm your brother. I want for you that which I want for myself, which is for you to be able to heal. I want you to be able to be healthy. I want you to be strong and powerful. I want you to be the God that you are. I want you to live and be around with me for the next 100, 200, 300, 400 years. And you and I, we meet up 300, 400 years from now. And we have a party, man. And we have a party, an abundant life party. <clears throat> family, I love you, family. I'm your brother here at Supreme Health and Fitness. It doesn't matter what nobody else has told you. I don't care what other doctors or healthcare providers or practitioners say. Listen to me. I'm trying to tell you how your body works. I'm trying to tell you that your body was created by God. And he made your body indestructible. Look at all of what you done went through so far. Look how strong and powerful you are. You done put up with so much so far already. Just imagine if you give yourself the ingredients that it needs, you will immediately create the power, the energy, and you can heal, you can be healthy, you can be powerful. 
I leave you as I came, bro. I thank you all for tuning in, and I leave you in the greeting words of peace. Assalamu alaikum. Black power. Power to the people.